Mr. Hazelton, the defendant is your mother, and it is your claim that she had you falsely arrested a little over a year ago for both stealing her property and for assaulting your sister, who tried to intervene and prevent you from taking her television. That's what the case is about. You spent, according to you, six days in jail. You finally bailed yourself out, and you want to be compensated for that. That's that what is the correct, case is about. Yeah. Prior to being arrested last year, when you were arrested on your mother's complaint, how many times had you been arrested before? A bunch. How many? More than a dozen? I could say yes. And were those, at least some of those arrests, drug-related? No. Were they alcohol-related? No. Were they physically-related? Were they assault cases? Some. But what does that got to pertain to this case? Everything pertains to this case. Were some of them involving theft? No. Was some of them involving trespass? No. So they were all involving assault. More than a dozen cases. What I'm gathering now is information. So of the more than a dozen arrests you had, none involved drugs, none involved alcohol, none involved theft, none involved trespass, all involved assault. Is that a yes or a no? That's a no. What else did they involve other than assault? I'm just talking about this case, Your Honor. I'm talking, okay. about, I'm talking about who the I'm party... I'm going to talk to about this case at hand. If you don't want to discuss this case, then we can just dismiss it. Great. Then I'm dismissing it. Thank you very much. All right. We're thank done. you. You have a good day. In a case recalled from earlier today, Glenn Hazelton says his mother, Nancy Hazelton, falsely accused him of assaulting his sister and stealing her TV. I should recall case 375 in the matter of Hazleton versus Hazleton. Thank Parties you. are reminded you're still under oath. You're welcome, Judge. Mr. Hazleton, Officer Bird tells me that you have had second thoughts about answering the court's questions, and you're asking me to reconsider the dismissal of this case. Is that correct? That is correct, Your Honor. Okay. So then let's get back to where I was questioning you before. According to your answers previously, you've been arrested at least a dozen times, none involving drugs. Is that correct? That is correct. None involving alcohol. That is, that is correct. None involving burglary. That is correct. None involving theft. That is correct. All involving assault. That is correct. Three times. So of the more than dozen times you've been arrested, it is as a result of either temper or a mental illness? if it wasn't drug or alcohol related? No, my anger gets the best of me. Well, that's an uncontrollable... It's an uncontrollable issue. ...for which you've been or not been in treatment? Not. Is it correct, Ms. Hazelton, that your son never had either a drug or an alcohol problem? Alcohol. In October of 2015, Mr. Hazelton, how were you supporting yourself? By working. For whom? Green Star Lawn Maintenance. How long have you worked for them? For 38 years, off and on. Are you working for them now? Yes. Full time? Yes. In the same location? Yes. Is that correct? I think so. Do you remember on what day you were arrested? Yeah, I was arrested on May 6, 2015. Where? In Henma County. Is that where you live? I lived, yes. What time were you arrested? About after about 12.20. In the morning? In the morning, yeah. And you were at home? I was at home, right. And you were arrested on the complaint of your mother and or your sister, I was or just your mother? I was arrested on my mother and sister's complaint stating that I walked in an unlocked door, used the restroom. Upon leaving the restroom, stole the TV out of my mom's room, hit my sister three times in the face, and left with the TV. Okay. You're the sister? No. Where is the sister? She's passed away. Were you at home that day? No. So the sister that you allegedly assaulted is no longer here? No. Is that correct? That is correct. And I gather from your answer that you were not at home when this took place? No. Did you have a conversation with your daughter when you got home? She was holding an ice... Just a second. Did you have a conversation with yes. her? Yes.